evidence for the reality of UFOs. We visited the outer perimeters of the top secret facility known as Area 51 in Nevada, claimed by some to house crashed and recovered UFOs. It was interesting that during a time spent in nearby Las Vegas, we managed to film this mysterious object, which hovered in the distance, right over Area 51, before shooting away at speed. Just a couple of years ago, while in the airport terminal of Rio de Janeiro, en route to attend a conference in Curitiba, Brazil, a pencil-thin object appeared overhead. It lingered long enough for us to capture these astonishing images. The very next day, while outside the conference venue in Curitiba itself, this unusual object appeared overhead. Was it pure coincidence that such objects should suddenly manifest themselves in front of an invited audience? In December last year, I had the good fortune to attend the first World UFO Forum in the Brazilian capital, Brasilia. The following sequence is taken from the opening ceremony and perhaps reflects the stature attached to what was by far the biggest and perhaps the most important UFO conference ever staged in the history of the subject. As you've no doubt already gathered, the importance that some attach to the UFO subject overseas is in stark contrast to the ridicule which is often heaped upon it here in Britain and the United States. Nonetheless, UFO researchers continue to plug away. These researchers are looking for something tangible which can be used as material evidence in the great debate. One of these is photo and video analyst Russell Callahan, who combines his professional work with sifting 